Welcome back. Now to the campaign trail. Surrogates for Vice President Kamala Harris are rallying supporters in some key swing states as former President Donald Trump spent some time speaking with Elon Musk. Yeah, they touched on everything from foreign conflicts to his plan to tackle illegal immigration. Jared Hill reports on the battle for the White House. He actually did something that was impossible. Former President Donald Trump back on his once favorite platform X, formerly known as Twitter, detailed the attempt on his life in a lengthy, friendly conversation with the company's owner, Elon Musk. What was it like for you? Not pleasant. I have not to be pleasant. I said there was blood. I had more blood. I didn't know fun. I had I didn't know I had that much blood. In the audio-only chat with Musk, who has endorsed Trump for president in 2024, the former president also went after President Biden and his 2024 opponent, Vice President Kamala Harris. She is a radical left San Francisco liberal, third-rate phony candidate. In response, the Harris campaign wrote, quote, Trump's entire campaign is in service of people like Elon Musk and himself, self-obsessed rich guys who will sell out the middle class and who cannot run a live stream in the year 2024. We will make history. The vice president off the trail, but in swing state Michigan, surrogates mobilized black women across Detroit. Running mate Tim Walls is set for a multi-state fundraising blitz starting today in Los Angeles. Jared Hill, CBS News. CBS News has learned the FBI is investigating whether Iranian hackers targeted individuals associated with both the Trump and Harris campaigns. Sources say the FBI launched the probe in early summer after both teams experienced attempted phishing schemes targeting campaign officials.